Household chores have long been a part of our lives. With the invention of the vacuum cleaner in 1901, cleaning was changed forever. Newer models have surely helped its efficiency. But the thought of robots taking over such a household chore was merely fiction decades ago. From now on, I don't think there'll be the slightest trouble with your robot. Your domestic problems are completely solved. But now, with the advancement of robotic technology, the mundane task of vacuuming can now be gone forever. Dream big and innovate tirelessly is the motto of NITO Robotics, our latest discovery in our ongoing search to seek out the most innovative toys on Earth. Based in California's Silicon Valley, NITO Robotics was founded on the concept that robots are smart enough to perform household chores as effectively as people. Mission accomplished with the introduction of NITO's vacuuming robot, the XV-11. NITO Robotics creators began as the winners of a business plan competition at Stanford University. In 2005, I believe, it was the winning entry, um, and that uh, came with it, I think, about $25,000 in um, seed money to start the company. And so the company actually began in an incubator from uh, some business school students. The motivation was really to create robots that could assume household tasks and do them in a way that a human would. So with that same level of sophistication, the same level of care that a human brought to it. So really fundamentally at its core, we knew we were developing what was a vacuum cleaner, but we also needed to develop some robotic technology and some ro robotic hardware uh, that didn't exist for us at the time. NITO was engineered from the ground up using revolutionary advanced AI algorithms and an infrared laser system. The core component we have that really allowed us to do everything that followed was uh, what we call the laser distance sensor. Um, and that's, that sits here on the robot. And so you can see that there, there's, there are ports around the outside. And what's under here is um, an infrared laser system. And it spins a rate of about uh, 7 hertz, so about 7 times a second. And this is the core of the robot's uh, laser vision and mapping system. The robotic vacuum continuously updates its progress on its map. The navigation system is designed to take the most efficient route, cleaning around objects in its path. NITO's team of talented engineers has developed patented technologies that make this robot the smartest of its kind. The NITO's AI is referred to as SLAM, or Simultaneous Localization and Mapping. SLAM is a system of artificial intelligence algorithms that supports the robot's self-awareness within its environment. Having an understanding of, of, of a map and then figuring out, okay, so how do we break up the space to clean it and track it? So that's one aspect of it, and there's, there's a lot of systems to support that. The other element of it is that we knew from the beginning we wanted to make a floor cleaner that was going to be like your upright vacuum. So we wanted the brush up in the front. Um, and so to do that, you really can't have a round shape. So therefore, the robot needs to be very aware of where its corners are. And so when it's navigating through space, um, whether it comes to chair legs or space between uh, a planter and a couch, it has to have an understanding of um, how wide am I at the front, where is the front, um, how do I slip through it to make sure that I, that I don't get hung up on it. The NITO features a front-side wraparound bumper that actuates if it encounters an obstacle. Small sensors on the sides of the bumper help it avoid obstacles while turning. The NITO even has cliff sensors that can detect stairs allowing it to clean right up to a ledge, then back away before careening off. And due to its advanced mapping system, the NITO can reach places even standard upright vacuums can't handle, like under beds. It will take your floor space and it will break it up into a very small grid, basically about one inch square. And it'll make sure that it's cleaned all of those grid spaces uh, before it decides it's done. Uh, so once it's covered every accessible point on the floor, and it'll go back to its charger and recharge until the next time it needs to go out. At the heart of the NITO vacuum system is a centrifugal compression impeller that mimics jet engine airflow principles to create sustained high-power suction, powerful enough to pick up virtually anything in its path. We really wanted to make it be like a vacuum cleaner, like, your, like what your upright is, where it's cleaning by airflow. And so, so we actually have a high compression uh, impeller on the inside here. And you'll notice that the brush itself doesn't have bristles. Uh, There's one thing we know, bristles are great for a sweeper because bristles are great at picking up things, not so good at letting them go. We didn't want to have a brush system that the user is going to have to clean out a lot. A large orange button wakes the robot up to start cleaning. The LCD allows for options such as scheduling time, status and report. If household cleaning is not your thing, just press a button and allow this technological marvel to map its path towards cleanliness.